Zealand's captain Kane Williamson with uh, a lot of weight on those shoulders having experience of Ross Taylor missing from the side today and it's Wokes on this pitch it's it through the gap Not perfectly timed but it could be good enough no chase from Owen Morgan three It'll test the hemi, won't it? It's amazing how much your hamstrings are better when it's your runs. <laughs> that experience. <Yeah. laughs> Just wide enough there for Caden Williamson to be able to really extend his arms, play through that shot. So I'm sure that Wokes will be wanting to just straighten up that line a little bit. No free hits. Brilliant work. Little hand on that. Standing behind point. Yeah, the reason that man's there at Gully is because there's not many people in world cricket that play the ball later than Kane Williamson. Plays it right underneath him. And that's what you need on this surface. Pinch one. In the air through. No, oh, it was catchable high. Luckily for Williamson, in the gap. I think Williamson had concern as soon as he hit it because his head went up very quickly. That gully fielder was there, backward point. And there was a moment where it did it go to hand and maybe could have been closer. Oh, it did fly though, didn't it? And again, this is classic. Oh, well, this one before. That's three in a row. Two fours and one two. Expert batting and 5,100 international runs for the New Zealand skipper. Well, Mark Wood persisting with the line well outside off stump. That is the onion, as they say, for a player like Kane Williamson. He likes the width. He Scores a lot of his runs in that backward point region. Three. Shall we say under? Good. The bad ball sometimes gets one and sometimes it goes for six. Oh, use the facilities. Just make them bounce. Oh, ordinary start. Very ordinary start from Moen Ali. Look to flight it. That is help yourself stuff, that. Get straight down the throat of Johnny Bairstow, but he did it well, and he's done that well too. A terrific player, and he will be organised against the off-spinner. Sure he's going to come on yet. Confident. Might be a bit grumpy as well. Will yeah. only be two. He only bowled two overs on a pitch that's spinning. Yeah, yeah, away. Yeah, Try and hit it too hard, Williamson. if you can just bring here long off up where Wokes is now stay in just stay in and make him hit it over you that's an attacking move yeah. and that's 50 for Williamson this game is not over until you get Kane Williamson out he's been uh, quiet in the runs department of late but that's a high class innings on a difficult pitch That run rate required could top up. And the gap nicely. Wide of the fielder. Could also go the other way. And it might just be an opportunity. A lesser bowl of your route. Opportunity for 
a class player like Williamson just to capitalize and anything short of a length he's cracked away good shot love the way he plays that shot Moy Morgan still has an over from Moy Ali. he's got a couple from Rashid it's at five fine enough to go all the way is it it is yeah, if you get an opportunity, you've got to take it, plain and simple. Warm-up ball from Stokes, a real loosener. Nothing on it, misdirected down the leg side. Williamson good enough to catch up with it. You cannot miss out on those opportunities. Yeah, and a good fortune, I suppose, the good fortune of, of that catch that... Saders... You know what I'm trying to say. Quite important that Kane Williamson has a lot of the strike, I think, isn't he? He seems to be pretty comfortable with Adil Rashid. Played a lot of cricket with him at Yorkshire. That's the one. And that's gone through, and that will be four. Well, there's a classic example of the mid-wicket. And England have been working on this in training. Mid-wicket, for some reason, goes deep and the angle has gone away from him. If he had been tighter in at mid-wicket, this would have been a regulation catch. And mid-wicket, for some reason, was on the edge of the circle. Maybe because Williamson was on strike, that would have gone straight to mid-wicket. Look how deep he is. Does neither. Can't stop the boundary or the catch. Nine from the over. Perfect result from New Zealand's point of view. Just the one, brilliantly fielded, Joe Root. Goes outside and over the top. Oh, not by much, but it was beautifully planned. And Williamson has another one-day hundred with a glorious stroke. Brilliant, brilliant innings on a tough pitch. What a magnificent player he is. Everyone at this ground is standing to applaud their captain. This is how he got there. He came into the innings a little bit out of Nick, carrying a hamstring injury, and not on a great pitch. He has found some form. What a player he is. How mentally strong he is. 18 from 11. That makes a difference. So this time. Happy to give it to Sodi. Is that the right move? Works again. Oh, he's hit a wide... Past Rashid. In fact, it's past Ali. Is it four? No, it's not. Stokes cuts it off. Two. He needed off four. Bumble was right. When he goes that wide, you can drag it even wider. To this point, here's Wokes again. Williamson has to hit big. How big? Really big. As big as you needed. Now New Zealand are back in it. Seven from three. What a game we've got thinking each other first part of the over to Chris Waltz he drags one down Williamson stays back and he nails it and he's now thinking why did I go away from my number one skill with the wide Yorker because he felt from England's point of view Williamson he dances it's beautifully bold they could get to here so he's going to have to go pressure on can Williamson make which end was the end to throw there? They may want Williamson out, but Sodi was the closer end. Five from referral. two. Can I check your uh, best Williamson angle, please? still on strike. Thank you. That's uh, not I out. I he's a bit nervous, old umpire Paliagura gay, but looks as if he's got one foot and the bat past the other stumps. That's the tension. Everyone's obviously feeling it. I suppose he's got to get it right. Wokes. Williamson charges. Oh, no. He doesn't want to take the run. Now he's got to hit the last ball for six for New Zealand to win. Or four, a tie. For wide Yorker. No, he can't. He can't. Sensational.
deflection off from Wokes. He hurt his, held his nerve. England go 2 1 up in the series. Williamson is so disconsolate. 112 not out. A lone warrior. And he's nearly brought to tears. Amazing scenes here. And so did that man on screen. Boy, did he deliver. He was let down by his teammates. He was let down by that middle order. Chris Wokes nailed his skill. Wide Yorker. Don't worry about that tram line. He'd moved across. And Owen Morgan and his team go one up in the series.